We didn't have a clue. I was waiting at the counter for 20 minutes until we got the manager and she got the whole thing wrong too. The only thing worse is if they won't let me give them less than one star. Oh, tell me about it. Cora and I were at this boutique avocado place the other day and the service was like, hashtag the worst. Gosh, Tan, don't you and Cora go anywhere apart from boutique avocado places? Well then, Jamie, let's just chill. How about you stop jerking off the birthday gift and tell us what you would do, hmm? Uh, um... I'd go on a road trip, you know. Sit by a dam, make a connection. Just, I don't know, just make a meaningful relationship, kind of like how old couples would have done in the olden days. My cousin has a property out in the middle of nowhere. I went there for a camping trip once, but honestly, the wife felt was so shit. Hey, did I tell you guys about the time I went to the vegan bacon rally? I must have been there for like 40 minutes before I realized this was a camping hell Hello, are you all done? Yeah, yeah, thanks. Okay. Alexa, turn the kettle on. Okay, your kettle has been switched on. <laughs> At least she's no two-faced bitch. Alexa, turn the lights on. Alexa, turn the lights on! What the fuck are you doing here? I thought you'd give me back your key. I got your signal at the bar. What signal, dickhead? Ugh! Go back to Spec Savers. I made it really clear last time that we're through. Come on, Jamie. I know you still need a man. <laughs> you have no idea what the fuck I need. Now get out of here before I call the cops. Alexa, call the police! You shouldn't have said that. <gasps> oh! 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 In the name of John Cleese's moustache happened in here, young lady. We charge so much for electricity nowadays that I have to keep the lights off half the time. And when I was in the laundry earlier, I tripped and fell and I broke the fridge. Of all the people in my life, why does she have to be the one to shop at Specsavers? Beauty sleep is what keeps my husband and I in tip-top shape. Beauty sleep. I'm... So very sorry, Janet. I see what you mean now by beauty sleep. It's almost hard to believe how much a witch you are. Were. <laughs> Bro, what the fuck? So how are you going back there, guys? Are you enjoying the scenic view of the countryside? It's beautiful. I've got some shapes if you guys want in here. Dude, I would love a chip right now if you're offering. <clears throat> oh, fucking wanker! God, you should be grateful obesity didn't kill him first. <laughs> Is 
It's a pity you're already dead. I would have loved to have seen you drown. Don't you just love the countryside? The fresh smell of air, the sweet sounds of crickets and bubbles. It's just amazing. Wait, you're not one of those boutique avocado place guys, are you? Okay, good. Good. You know, I've always wanted someone to connect with, build a relationship with, fall in love with. Fuck, these glasses are great, Gemma. Just perfect to see everything. This beautiful scenery. Damn, there's no place I'd rather be than here with you guys. Not even warm in my bed. Not even sitting at the beach on a warm sunny day. It's just amazing. I'm so happy here. You know what, guys? I wish that you guys were my real friends. You, you don't play dead. Ah, oh, never do that again. Like, ever. Shelly, we are coming to your cousin's place ever again. Oh, and Jamie, it's your fault that it's raining right now. Oh, honestly, you and this weather are so, are both so fucking sad, Jamie. Just kill me now.